In this tutorial, I'll show you how to tilt a curve point to create this abstract art. I'll create a new curve point. If you don't see this menu item, please activate an extra objects add-on. We need to convert this to 3D and type E to extrude. Let's select both curve point, the right click and type S to subdivide it multiple times. I'll use the proportional editing tool to move the middle point on the Z axis like this. Type A as in alpha, V as in Victor, and A as in alpha to smooth the curve. Let's create a cube and subdivide it twice in edit mode by right clicking and typing S. I'll type C to use a circle select tool. The idea is to extrude the selected faces on the side face loop. We need to scale and remove the faces on the front and the back like this. After that, I added two modifiers on the cube. How do we tile or rotate the mesh in the front? If I rotate it, the curve point will certainly rotate, but that won't rotate the mesh. I created a mesh that has extruded parts to show you how this works clearly. There is a hidden feature called Mean Tilt in Blender that allows us to tile a curve to rotate the attached meshes. Not only that, we can also increase the radius of a curve point. Let's select some points like this, and tilt them.
That's how we rotate the meshes that are attached to curve points. I'll create a simple render scene by adding metallic materials for both meshes, and use sky texture to produce a final render image. Let's work on the composite nodes a bit. This is the end of the tutorial. Thank you for watching.